Hi guys, as you know, I uh, took off two weeks in September 2008 to witness this. To raising public awareness. On September 18th, 2008, the Secretary of the Treasury, Henry Paulson, and the Chairman of the Federal Reserve, Ben Bernanke, arrived for an emergency meeting at the Capitol. On Thursday, late afternoon, we go to Nancy Pelosi's office, and there's a meeting of the senior legislators from both parties in both House and Senate. In the past seven months, they had bailed out one bank and let another one fail, nationalized three of the nation's largest companies, and watched in horror as the credit markets froze. It was obviously a big meeting. I had no idea I was going to hear what I heard. I turned it right over to Ben Bernanke and Hank Paulson. And they said they needed authority to use $700 billion to uh, unstop the credit markets. And sitting in that room with Hank Paulson saying to us in a very measured tones, no hyperbole, no excessive adjectives, that unless you act, the financial system of this country and the world will melt down in a matter of days. Bernanke said, if we don't do this tomorrow, we won't have an economy on Monday. There was literally a pause in that room where the oxygen left. Now, all those people in that room didn't see the financial collapse coming, yet I did. Now they're telling me, those same people are telling you that uh, everything's going to be fine, that uh, quantitative easing, printing of money out of nothing, and buying up treasuries, buy, buying up mortgage-backed securities, buying up all kinds of debt, that's not going to cause a problem. You're welcome to believe that if you like, but me, I'm going to stick with reality. <laughs> 